in his lab of course uh, the largest value pe company here in india in terms of the pharma sector declared its numbers last week on saturday and one of the key takeaways was that the growth for the company continued i mean some of the companies that have declared numbers earlier did see some decline even in the api segment in which uh, you know dvs operate some of the other companies which have smaller segments into that did see a decline and most of the companies maintain that you know chinese players are back in the market with a bang and that is one of the key reasons are to see that particular decline but dv's numbers continue to be robust continue to be in line or higher than estimate remember that dv's is a company where expectations always are pretty high going into the numbers since 2003 since their listing uh, they have shown phenomenal growth and that is something which continues to be the case uh, in terms of dv's margins exceeded estimates result uh, sales numbers as to, uh, exceeded the estimates and so did the pack numbers so overall the numbers were expected to be good with a 30 40% growth and that is the case that has happened as far as dv's goes uh, in terms of dv's uh, they have started recently to have a call and talk about api what's the way ahead what did the quarter happen uh, so first just talking about the quarter dvs of course uh, was uh, at a lifetime high going into the numbers it did see some sort of correction but going into the numbers you know once again expectations were high and that is essentially what they have delivered in terms of pat a 31% plus growth in terms of margins i was just looking at the gross margins for dvs it is in extent or northward of 69% if i'm not wrong almost 8 9 years is back what i have checked it is at an all time high so gross margins came in at a all time high despite the sort of capex that the company has done despite the sort of investments that the company has done their growth continues to be uh, quite 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 uh, you know largely overall uh, quite phenomenal and that is the case in terms of margins as well now also they had a conference call as i told you recently they have started to have a conference call speak to and this speak to uh, you know buy side fund managers and there mr murli devi who of course is the promoter of the company was quite bullish about the commentary going ahead they were quite sure about business coming in they were quite sure about the capex uh, that they are doing and how it will essentially be streamlined overall the commentary was pretty strong as far as dv's numbers or you know murli devi uh, dv's is uh, concerned he also particularly said that the china one strategy is benefiting the company they expect a lot more contracts to come in uh, for newer and newer products for innovative companies that they tend to make this particular product for for the last three quarters they have been looking in at capex looking in at capex or you know enhancing their capex and that is something uh, which they going ahead maintained as well now a lot of brokers have written about dvs and the likes of bofa securities uh, who was neutral earlier has gone ahead and uh, you know upgraded the company to a buy the target prices are now in the range of 4400 4200 to about 4500 with 4400 being the mean uh, and that is essentially the new target prices earlier it was between 4000 to 4200 which has been enhanced by about 5 to 6 or 7